I say this with all seriousness in my heart. If you see a picture of my wife and you look at her and you look at me and you say, bruh, I don't get it. It's not fair. I agree. I, I don't get it either. I mean, how? <laughs> her being married to me is proof that life is not fair and that God is amazing because the Bible says he'll give you the desires of your heart. Do I deserve a woman of such radiant beauty, such effortless class and elegance and and, and, and a flawless beauty? Absolutely not. But here and still, she took my last name. Look at me. No hairline. No beard grow right here. Razor bumps. And yet, a woman of this caliber and beauty is my wife. If I weren't me, I would hate me. I'd be like, bro, look at bro and look at her. And to you, I say, Indeed. Not only did she marry me, <laughs> she she had children with me, two boys. She lives at my home. When I go to sleep, I reach out and touch. It's her. <laughs> and here's the thing, guys. Here's what makes it worse. All you see is the beauty in these pictures. You don't see the inner beauty, the love, the friendship, the companionship, the, the business acumen, the, the person to bounce ideas off of, the person to give me great ideas, the joke tagger, the person who says that joke's not working like you think it is, the person who says it's too long, it's just perfect. Push harder here. You can negotiate better than that. Are you comfortable? Are you getting rest? How do you feel? What do you want to eat? Did you put gas in my car? Sometimes it's just her asking me to do stuff, but most of the time it's her just being 100% Pure love. Oh. I would be frustrated seeing me and her walk down the mall. We walk, I would look back and say, him? Him. <laughs> ah, sucks to be you guys.